Should we but, get a stretch? Or? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so listen, as important as it is to work out our bodies, it is equally important that we're putting all of the right nutrients back. <laughs> so true. So entrepreneur Rachel DeVoe, there she is. Mm -hmm. She's passionate about health and wellness, like Marisol and myself, and Thank she's been sharing her hacks and motivation to help inspire others on their personal journeys on her gram and beyonds. I'm sorry, I can't get over the barbell I know. squat stepping up to the who's and the what's I mean, it's a it's a complex. It is a complex. <laughs> and a complex. Is, she is now inspiring people in the kitchen with her first ever published cookbook, and you are definitely going to want to get your hands on it. Uh -huh. She joins us this morning with some simple uh, ways to work up a sweat, and then we're going to have a delicious recipe to refuel, yeah. baby. Yes, that's right. Without any further ado, thanks for having me. Rachel, Thank you welcome. so much. Oh my gosh. She came from honor. Hands up. She came from where? She hails from the Seattle. PNW, the Pacific oh, okay. Northwest, if you shall. Oh, okay. uh, so you were passionate about nutrition starting mm -hmm. in college, which is very interesting, because I was a D1 athlete, and I was like, well, I'm working oh. out a couple times a day, so oh. let me just go to the cafeteria and put whatever. It doesn't oh. matter. I wish I had the wherewithal to have really... See, it really hit me in high school that, okay. like, okay, the light bulb came on. Yeah. Food does play a huge factor yeah. in performance and fuel and recovery, so I love blending the two. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's important. And I suppose that their different workouts will result in a different fuel source mm -hmm. afterwards. Because I think, like, I'm training for a triathlon. That doesn't mean Good I can. Eat, I, no, I'm, I'm not. I, I was. I can do that. She, I was. She, but it's easy to say. It but it's easy to say, oh, I'm training for a triathlon. Let me eat the entire cake. Right. And, <laughs> and maybe, maybe that's not the right thing to do. Mm -hmm. Right. But yeah. you know, sometimes, it, and it, it takes somebody like Rachel yeah. to help us because sometimes after a workout like that, you're like, I'm. Radish. Yeah. I got your back. Thank we you. are going to have something right after this. Let's okay, focus great. on three moves right now. There's Let's some of it. my favorite. Okay. First, we have in and out jump squats. And oh, I boy. love a good resistance band. You, ha you, you, you have she has three of them. What's the difference? So we have light, medium, and heavy. So depending okay. on the exercise, depending on where you want to go with it. Okay. Let's use the green. This okay. is medium. medium. Okay. So you're going to load it up. All right. Load it up, baby. And I'm going to show you a modification for this. Right above so the knee. Right above the Never knee. Never on okay. the knee. I'm going to go a little bit angled here. Okay, We're going to start wide, and you're going to jump to the oh, center, keeping that resistance in your band. Oh, so keeping about a foot. Oh, so with don't the go part. all the way in. Don't go oh, all boy. the way in. Always keep. And resistance. then a good way to modify it is just taking out the jump, just stepping in and out. Um, a <sighs> band is a great way to just slow it down, focus yeah. on your form. Let me and tell you really something. Targets. Oh boy. Whew. So it's Alex, burning. It's Alex already burning. and I like to lift heavy, th heavy things and then throw those heavy things. <laughs> This, my friend, mm -hmm. using my own body weight and my own resistance, I'm winded. And you don't need weight with it. No. Like, you can get a great workout with just the band. You can take it on vacation. It's great for yes. busy people, busy moms. Yep. Yeah. You can get a workout in five minutes and 30 minutes. All right, what's the next move? Next one is front to back lunges. I love this oh one for warming up a workout. Okay. I include these a lot in my own workout. Mm -hmm. So taking your right foot, you're going to step forward, bring it back to center and then step back in a reverse lunge. Ay, Dios Uy. Mio. Uy. This is a good one. I mean, this is gonna get you winded. It's gonna <sighs> warm your glutes up, your hamstrings, your mm -hmm. quads, and then you're gonna switch legs. Few reps. So yes, Mar that's what I Marisol was... likes to even her sides out. I do. I feel <laughs> I feel very uncalibrated mm. if I do too many sets on one side. Um, for folks who have never done this type of exercise before, is there anything they should know? Is she, you know, if it hurts or if it because it seems like a pretty pedestrian exercise, but for first timers. <gasps> Give them one Bands are actually a great way for beginners to great. start exercising. It's also good for athletes. So kind yeah. of any yes. range, you can add it to so many different exercises, which I love. I told you, this is my friend. For Listen, my they're very Abram. cute, too. Yeah. We Third. love a good aesthetic band. Yes. <laughs> Next <laughs> one, we're going to focus on upper body. So you're going to put it just below your wrists. We're going to sit down into a squat of position. Of course we are. Okay. And you are, at the same time, going to be pushing, Ooh. driving your hands laterally. Uh-huh. So you're keeping that resistance, oh, bring mio. it to your chest, Ay. keeping down in your squat the entire time. We're not standing up. So I love this. It's not just working your upper okay. body, your arms, yeah. your delts, but you're staying in that squat position. So okay. it is going to burn. I, I wish feel... everyone else in the room had to be doing this right now, too. <laughs> also, I feel an ab that yes, has been dormant. Core, I'm telling you guys, it works everything. So you can use a band for all kinds of exercises. This upper is body, fantastic. Body. Killer. 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 Alex, I'm hungry. <laughs> Let's take it to the kitchen, ladies. Let's do uh, it. We need some sustenance now. Okay, so for a workout like that, let's say we did that for what, 30 minutes? Let's rendezvous. Let's rendezvous. 30 minutes. I love focusing on protein. Yes. Okay. It's going to help build and repair your muscles. Sure. Okay. I'm here for that. 
Right now we're gonna do a quick little oh. salad. This is actually in my cookbook. It's called Bridger's Favorite Salad. And yes, this is my and husband. Bridger. <laughs> we heard a little, a little interesting tidbit about your yes. husband. Doesn't like what? vegetables? I mean, it took him a little bit. Mm -hmm. He was He's picky. I think a lot of people can relate to wanting yes. to eat healthy, yes. yeah. but maybe it's hard to get their family members or people they love on the same Page. kind of train, yeah. you know? Yeah. And so this is a great salad. You'll find a lot of recipes in my cookbook that are staple favorites that you might have eaten growing up. So okay. I love classics, yep. but remaking them using healthier ingredients. Love a classic, all right. I see some springs. Spring, spring mix? Set. Yeah, spring mix. We have a spring mix. This is gonna be strawberry mash oh sticks. <laughs> We're gonna add, mash sticks. Just gonna add everything in here. We have apple yeah. mash sticks as I well. Love this. Some goat cheese. Oh, I love a goat cheese. I love goat cheese. Walnuts for some crunch. Mm. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna add some balsamic. balsamic. Yes, yeah, buddy. Mama. Okay. So I'm telling and you, when he first had this salad, he loved it. So is I'm it true, Bridger? <laughs> okay. He was I'm like, okay, fine, I'll marry you. <laughs> <laughs> the way that it is through the stomach. Now, for Look folks who. Um, some people think, oh my gosh, I'm adding goat cheese. That's fattening. Mm. Or I'm adding that is so this dated. It, right. Or, or <laughs> healthy fats are great for you. You need the healthy fats. I, ice macros. Hello. We still have people in our lives. I know. I know. Yes. Who say, I don't want to do the cheese. It's fattening. Or <clears> there's <throat> sugar <Nana>. in that. <laughs> there's sugar in that in that piece of fruit. Or that you know, it's a healthy fat, but it's still a fat. Right. I love healthy fats. They keep you satiated. They keep you full for longer. And they're great brain boosting fats. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Especially those so, walnuts. So I had a little lot. portion made for you guys if you want to come. Let me and dive try right in. Oh, this is gorge. Now, Bridger, how many times a week do you eat this? In the summer, like three times a week. Okay, three good. times a week. So we love pairing this with a quality protein like oh. chicken, my yeah. turkey burgers that are also in the cookbook. <gasps> it's I love a great a combo. Very delicious. good. Very good. Now, work hard, play hard. That's right. I spy with my little eye. We a, have a sugary dessert, confection. baby. We have my famous Twixies here. Okay. My Twix bars, I am such a Twix I've die I've seen hard. those on her Instagram. Is that right? Do you like the left one or the right one? Oh. <laughs> That's how they sell them now. Because you can't buy it. Left twix really? Or a right twix. Girl, when Wait, you go I'm so behind because I only make these. Let me tell you what. With the healthy version, you put, you put you the put whole thing in your mouth. It's the whole thing. There's a left twix. There's a right twix. This is the Rachel twix. Right. <laughs> this is my twix. Um, this is my fan favorite recipe. I feel like the dessert recipes in my cookbook. It's the biggest chapter. Okay. I love focusing on <laughs> I sweets. I love that so much. Um, there's no refined sugar in it. We have oh. maple syrup to sweeten, oh. which is actually high in antioxidants. Yep. Yep. So I. I look at food in terms of fuel. How is it going to benefit our bodies? This is a healthy remake, and you're not going to sacrifice on flavor okay. by eating healthy. What else do we have going on? We should on probably here? try we this. We should. I think you know, just just let's to, do the world to, a favor. Let's. You look said, at this. I see some flaky seeds. It's a on thick. Top. Oh, we got a thick piece going on. Oh my gosh. And what is? Give us. Run down the. Okay, so it's a time. shortbread layer to start. Oh. Then we have a almond butter caramel layer in the middle, topped with dark chocolate and flaky sea salt on top. Stop it right now. This is the best thing I've ever put in my mouth. My trick is to keep a stash in your freezer so you can I'm just grab a stash. Cut it in small pieces and grab a bite when you have a. Tell us craving. about your book signing tonight. Ah, yes. So my first cookbook, Rachel's Good Eats, comes out today, and I can't believe it. It's a two-year. Process. Labor of love. Labor of love. No one really tells you how intense yeah. it is until you go through it. But um, there's 110 healthy recipes. It's all gluten free, dairy free, and refined sugar free. Amen. Again, you're not sacrificing on flavor. No, we, it's so important. we can tell you firsthand. I love this, that. Everything tastes delicious. 